Hey, what's going on guys? Mr. The Reverts here. Today I just want to make this quick video and talk to you guys about the CWL League or the Call of Duty World League if you guys don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, because I just got done watching the Optic vs. E United series and oh my god, that definitely was one of the best series I've ever seen in Call of Duty competitive history. And it's definitely one of the best championship games of all time, hands down. But part of the reason why I wanted to make this video is because of this clip on screen right now. I'm going to show you guys in a second here, but uh, Optic was down pretty much uh, 6-1 to one, and they basically just came back with 30 seconds left to tie up the game to force another game of uplink so i'm gonna play this clip for you guys right now is on the flank he's gonna pick up the last defender krim is gonna put this one in player number five karma has a camo as well this is doable but they know there's gonna be a player on the flank karma has the camo he's gonna get oh, this dunk in. it's a one point game after this one goes through this is gonna come down to that gunfight in the middle of the map you do have arsity still alive with overdrive, he actually could pick up the drone and get out of the way, but with only one point needed for Optic Gaming, they the throw pass. the drone over. He has camo. Karma going for the one. Yes. With one second left, Karma hits the toss. What did Optic Gaming just do? Five points in your final 70 seconds. Now, guys, moments like this is exactly why I love to play and watch competitive Call of Duty. And uh, there's just so much money on the lines at these events. And of course, me being a huge Optic fan and seeing this team uh, this team play right here got me really, really hyped. And I was in a Skype call with my friends today. And I literally got up out of my chair and started screaming and putting my hands on my head and pacing back and forth around my room. Because just this play was one of the craziest plays I've ever seen, especially for Uplink. And, you know, like being down 6-1 to one with 30 seconds left on the clock. And then to score those 5 points needed in that short amount of time to tie up the game is just so intense. But it really, I just want to make this video to... You know, try to get you guys to watch competitive Call of Duty if you guys don't already. At least once in a while. I know you guys might have a busy schedule, but I mean, just moments like this can really get you just so intense. And uh, I have this fiery passion for Call of Duty, especially for competitive Call of Duty, because I feel that uh, competitive Call of Duty is going to be the future of the game. And, uh, you know, every year the these events get better and better. And so, yeah, I really do encourage you guys to watch the uh, the next event here. It's going to be MLG Anaheim. I think it's going to be on uh, on June 17th or the 16th. I'm not really sure which one, but I have more information in the description. But like I said, guys, I really do encourage you guys to go watch these events because, you know, just watching competitive Call of Duty and then these pro players play can really get you better at the game. And that's honestly how or one of the reasons why I got better at the game because back in, in MW2, I was really, really bad. But then... Coming into Black Ops 3, I started watching a lot of competitive players and uh, some game battles matches and scrims and stuff like that. And I immediately noticed a huge change in my in, in my gameplay skills. So I really do encourage you guys to watch competitive players because it could definitely get you better at the game. But uh, yeah, guys, sorry for the late upload. But I just wanted to make this video to just really show this clip. It's so This clip was honestly one of the craziest uh, clips I've ever seen in competitive Call of Duty. So yeah, guys, I'm sorry for the late upload again. Uh, comment your thoughts about this, guys, down in the comments. And also tell me if you guys are a, a fan of competitive competitive Call of Duty, and if you are, what's your favorite team? Let me know that down in the comments as well, and also drop a like if you guys did enjoy, and thank you all so much for watching, I'm Avert, have a great rest of the day, until next time, I'll catch you guys later.